Hi Paul, I'm Chris from Budget Cars. I received your email inquiry from you about our CRV. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a video on the car, let you know exactly what it looks like, dents, scratches, all that sort of stuff, because you are looking at second hand cars and I want you to know exactly what you're getting. Um, I do have a similar arrangement with the girl over in France and what she does every year is she comes over, she takes for a couple months and she gets me to pick her car for her and she sells it off and then contacts me again. Uh, this year I actually chose her one of these as well, I chose her a CRV. Um, I chose them because I trust them, they're good, they're reliable, they got a good transmission in these ones. Um, yeah, so I'll do that and then I usually take it for a drive, I get the AA to check it over as well because I'm not actually a mechanic myself, but I do get the AA to check it as well and that way we know exactly what you're getting. Um, other than that, if you're not comfortable with that, we can just pick a car closer to the time if you're not happy to pay for the car right now and chuck down deposit, come in with a week or so and pick it up. Or we, you can just come in, we do have about 500 cars here, we've got a whole bunch of four wheel drives, but for now I'll just do a video on this car and see what you think, hey? Cheers. Well here she is, she is actually rather quite nice and tidy, I've gone over and had a quick look at her already. Uh, there are a few small scratches here and there, but nothing major, no big dents or anything. So starting off, there's a bit of light scratching along here. To be honest, most of that would probably be taken out with a bit of cutting compound, so I wouldn't really worry about that. Uh, headlights rather quite nice, can't see any water in them or anything like that. There's a small stone chip here, which I can get touched up anyway, make it look a lot nicer. And. The bottom is all rather quite nice, can't see any scratches and all that sort of stuff. She's got her fog lights because she's um, actually one of the highest spec CRVs. She's got her chrome wheels, she's got her leather interior, she's got her four wheel drive. Not all CRVs are four wheel drive so that's something that's actually rather quite unique with this one. And awesome thing is, is she's actually got an aftermarket Japanese radio. Which means that if you wanted a New Zealand one, which if you're coming on holiday I'm sure you do. The uh, best way to ruin atmosphere in a car is not have a decent radio. Yeah. So uh, you can swap that out for a New Zealand one without having to pay for a dashboard because quite often dashboards can cost you a couple hundred bucks. So you pull that out, chuck a new one in, we can organise that for you if you like. Um, yeah, so that's all there. Now she does have a screen up there. Um, because it's a Japanese car, whether or not it works, I do not know. I'd have to fiddle around, take, um, take a couple minutes, try to figure that out. She does actually have a chest seatbelt, not a waist seatbelt for the second passenger there. You can see it up there on the roof. So it's a lot safer for the kids and all that sort of stuff. And because she's leather, she'll be a lot easier to clean and all that if you're coming with kids. Um, a little bit more scratch in there. Like I said, those look pretty light. They look like they can probably be taken out with a bit of cutting compound. Uh, can't promise, but I can try. Uh, just a few more scratches here and there. Coming around through the back. So you do actually have this tray here to protect it. And you do also have the parcel tray as well. Now if you don't want the parcel tray then you pull this out and then this here actually fits perfectly into that cutout there. Awesome. And there's the back, she's actually rather nice and tidy. Small scratch there. Yeah, small scratch. Down there. The alloy wheel, uh, the chrome wheel, sorry, actually rather quite nice and tidy. Quite often you get a lot of curving with these sort of cars, um, but these ones haven't really been curved. They're actually rather nice, tidy wheels, which is awesome. Yeah. I'm gonna just come in, show you the driver's seat. Uh, door is actually rather nice and tidy as well because that's one of the major points that generally take a hitting. And here above the electric seat controls is also where it usually takes a lot of hitting and down there but that's all rather nice and tidy which is awesome. Now I'm just going to pop the bonnet and show you the inside. Awesome. Here she is. She's actually got a new battery, so you won't have to worry about it for three years, which is far more than your state in New Zealand, so that's awesome. Uh, she is actually rather nice and tidy. I cannot see any obviously repainted spots or anything like that that suggest accident damage. We do try to stick to the higher auction grades here so that we generally don't get that sort of stuff anyway. So that's not to worry about. And I'm sure if you look us up on um, Facebook and Google and all that sort of stuff, we do have a good reputation. Awesome. Well, I'll send you this link if you like the car let me know if you want to continue with this one i'll take it for a drive i'll make sure the mechanics check it over and all that sort of stuff and then once you pay we can hold it for you and all that awesome sweet as see ya